So uh, one of the problems on the last assignment, we had a, a 30, 60, 90, and I'm just going to sketch it. Boom, boom. This was, we knew that this was 60, and we were told that the side opposite the 60 is um, 1 tenth. And then what we're supposed to do is find the A and B values if this is 1 tenth. So let's start with what we know about 30, 60, 90. So if this side's 1, the side that's opposite the 30 is a half of that. And the side that's opposite the 60 is uh, root 3 over 2. Basically, that one times root 3. So there's a couple of ways you can think about this. Uh, one is just, um, I like to do proportional triangles this way. So like, this is just going to be a scaled version of, of this triangle. Because it's, it's similar because the angles are all the same. So I could figure out, like, root 3 over 2 times what gives me 1 tenth. Um, and you, you might just see it. You might just say, you know, you need, you need to cancel out the root 3, so there's going to be a root 3 in the bottom. The 2 is going to get multiplied to a 10, so that's to be a 5 in the bottom. So it's 1 over 5 root 3. That's my multiplier. That's my scalar. If you don't see that, you can set up um, just something that's to solve. Uh, root 3 over 2 times x equals 1 tenth. Multiply both sides, you know, you solve by x, so multiply by that. That cancels out to a 1, so it's 1x. Uh, 2 goes into 10 five times, root 3. So that's my multiplier. So basically what I have to do is multiply everything by that. So 1 times that is 1 over 5 root 3. And 1 half times that. If I multiply by a half, it's a 1 in the, in the numerator, and 2 times 5 is 10. Uh, 10 root 3 in the denominator. That's a 10, sorry, sloppy. So there's one way that we could go about doing it. It's just uh, thinking about similar triangles, scaling it up. Um, the other thing we could do is look at it. I'm just going to clear this off. Uh, look at it about the relationships that are between these sides. So like that's half of that. This is that times root 3. So notice that whatever goes here, whatever's opposite the 30, if I multiply it by root 3, it's opposite the 60. So basically divide that by root 3. So that'd be 1 over 10 root 3, right? I'm dividing it. I'm undoing the multiplying. And... Since this is a half of that, I could double it to go this way. And if I double that, I get 2 over 10 root 3, the 2 tenths reduced to a 1 fifth root 3, 1 over 5 root 3. Um, so there's two different kind of ways to think about it. It's all about thinking about proportions. This triangle and this triangle, they're similar. They have some proportional um, relationship about the sides.